Hello to all A32 Vixen, 22LS Foxbat and Kelpie owners around the country. This is a short video which will try to showcase the proper way to inspect the coolant system in your aircraft and in particular the hoses located at the rear of the engine at the coolant pump. All Rotex engine, even the certified versions, utilize hose clamps and other pressure fittings to secure the hoses to the various engine components. The coolant system utilizes fairly large diameter hoses in comparison to the oil due to its large high flow rate and therefore those hoses are more susceptible to expand and contract under pressure and heat. While many pilots perform a very thorough pre-flight inspection of the aircraft and its control system, not many actually check the engine components and system with the attention and detail they deserve. The pre-flight checklist called for a daily inspection of all hoses in the engine bay. This is in addition to the regular maintenance requirement which are done at 25 hours for new aircraft and then at 50 at 100 hours uh, for other inspection. This issue was additionally raised by Recreational Aviation Australia back in 2010 with the notice to all members regarding a proper inspection of the coolant system. One hose I like to point in particular is the hose located at the rear of the engine. This is the coolant pump which uses a fairly large 1 inch diameter hose. This hose is susceptible to expansion and contraction with pressure, heat and is operated regularly in vibration. Simple and regular pre-flight and maintenance check of the hoses, their clamps and fittings will ensure ongoing safe operation without any leaks and enjoyable flying. 